<clears throat> Hi everyone, my name is Andrea Suarez. Today we're going to talk about your three steps to waste savings. So this video is going to give you a really good idea of what our waste review process is and what it looks like for you and your company. So we estimate that 90% of companies nationwide are overspending on waste. We've made our review process thorough so that no savings opportunity is missed. These three simple steps have saved companies millions of dollars over the past 18 years, so we know that there's a really good chance they can work for you too. During our review process, we review your contracts and invoices for inefficiencies or errors. We analyze your service levels and equipment, and we implement cost-cutting solutions. This process consistently reduces gross waste expenses by an average of 10 to 30% each month. Review your contracts and invoices for inefficiencies or errors. So our process is completely remote. You and your staff are busy. You don't need a team to come on site and disrupt your day. We're able to consistently save companies 10 to 30% simply by reviewing waste documents and asking critical questions of your site managers. We compile copies of every waste and or recycling contract you have, 12 month invoice history or hauler portal logon information so that we can access that history and a list of site addresses. Those are the, uh, oh, and additionally, a list of site management or manager contact information. These are the things we need to kick off the waste review process. Most companies are able to send us all of this information in under four hours. From this information, we are able to compile a complete picture of your waste and recycling management process. We input all information into a master analysis sheet that lists every location, every piece of waste equipment on your sites, contract expiration dates, and fee information. This is the most detailed part of the review process because we take pains to ensure we have a clear picture of what your waste process truly is. Then we analyze that information to see what your waste process should be. The next thing we do is analyze your service levels and waste equipment. So once the data is compiled, we find the gross waste output for every piece of equipment you have on site. Then we find your inefficiencies and the correlating service opportunities. Take Rhonda Cummings of Presbyterian Homes, for instance. She had waste problems she didn't know about, just like many of you. She was paying ancillary fees and she had inaccurate service levels. As a result, Rhonda was overpaying by $22,000 in her waste expenses every year before we stepped in. We adjusted her contracts and we fixed her service levels. Common waste problems include too many pickups, wrong dumpster sizes, not selling recyclable byproducts. This is mainly for the manufacturing industry, not using cost reducing waste equipment like compactors or having poor waste or poor quality contracts, not limiting price hikes on contracts and not eradicating the auto renewal clause. And then the last one is paying waste expenses at above market rates. So the waste industry isn't set up to help you manage your waste disposal efficiently. It's set up for haulers to make a profit. As a result, most of the companies we work with have at least one of these problems and it's costing them. How many of these, issue, these issues do you have? We create waste solutions that are beneficial to both you and your waste hauler. In fact, we complete this, this part of the analysis for free. You only pay us when we find savings. And even then, you only pay us out of the savings we find for you. We share in the savings at a rate of 50%. So implementing those cost-cutting solutions. After we have created a thorough plan to address your waste disposal problems, we present it to you. We ask your top level leadership to gather on a teleconference and we, are, and we present a slideshow containing information for each of the cost cutting solutions we've discovered for your locations. It's important for us to vet all solutions with you so that we can get your feedback. We learn everything we can about potential obstacles uh, to our solutions before this presentation, but sometimes there are unforeseen hiccups. There may be a last minute construction job or another situation that could delay solution implementation at a certain site. We almost always implement the majority of our proposed solutions, but every so often the implementation timeframe gets adjusted according to client needs. After we've discussed the plan going forward, we make those critical changes. 
Depending on your situation, this may include some or more of the following. Renegotiating contracts with better terms, getting new contracts with better pricing, adjusting service levels, adjusting waste and recycling equipment. We ensure smooth transitions occur as necessary, and we are proactive about keeping everyone on your team and at your sites in the loop as those transitions occur. When hiccups occur, we resolve them. And going forward, we resolve all service and contract issues at every one of your sites. You can completely offload that responsibility to us. When your current contracts expire, we get vendor bids to make sure you're paying the absolute best rates. We're committed to your savings, present and future. So there's a 90% chance we can find you savings. Our review process is painstaking. Our, analysis, our analysis is thorough and our implementation process is convenient. As a result, we find savings for companies just like yours over 90% of the time. We consistently reduce gross waste spend by 10 to 30% and our ongoing services ensure no future savings opportunity is missed. Schedule a free consult to learn more. You can likely sign up for one in the next hour. You are the only thing sitting between you and savings. Sign up using this link right now.